वेलकम बैक टू द विद्यार्थी विद्यार्थी चैनल में आपका स्वागत है टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू कंटिन्यू मेंचुरेशन सीरीज पार्ट 6 इफ यू आर नॉट सीइंग आवर प्रीवियस वीडियोस आई एम गोइंग टू पुट अ लिंक इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स प्लीज चेक द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स फॉर द अदर फाइव वीडियोस ऑन मेंचुरेशन सो लेट अस स्टार्ट विद टुडेस क्वेश्चन बिफोर दैट थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर सब्सक्राइबिंग माय चैनल एंड दोस हु हैव नॉट सब्सक्राइब कैंडली सब्सक्राइब एंड डोंट फॉरगेट टू प्रेस द बेल आइकन Given a, a triangle ABC with angle A, the vertex angle is 78 degree, uh, the vertex angle at B is 68 degree, and the vertex angle at C is 34 degree. You have to find the area of a triangle uh, if only two sides have been given. This is AB is 18 centimeter, AC is 30 centimeter. Uh, one thing about this question is it is not drawn to the scale, so just uh, this is only to Uh, give an idea about how the question looks like to find the area of triangle abc we need to find so the first step should be to find bc so let us find first find bc for that we need to do construction so we will take a scale and try to Draw a line from A till D such that AD is is equal to 18 centimeter. So, since AD is equal to 18 centimeter, this side is equal to this side. So, this is our construction. So, what we have done is we have constructed AD so that. AD is equal to 18 centimeter. Now, if this is 18 centimeter, then this has to be 18 centimeter means this has to be 68 degrees. So one more thing, in triangle ABC, step two, we need to find out. the altitude ae which i can draw this as as a perpendicular from a on side bc this is ae now this is your perpendicular h which acts as the altitude for the triangle abc as well as ae b and aec so you can see this is a common perpendicular to all the three triangles as i said a triangle adc 68 degree at angle ade adb is an external angle an external angle for which angle dca angle dca plus angle cad should be equal to 68 now we know that what is dca it is 34 degree plus cad is equal to 68 therefore angle cad is also 68 minus 34 that is 34 So we have got another thirty-four degree angle here, which was not given in the question. So if you take this as thirty-four and this as thirty-four, this side is also equal to this side. This implies that DC also is eighteen centimeter. So we have got 
part of this DC which is equal and then you draw a perpendicular from A to E perpendicular from from A to E to the side BD will also act as a median for the isosceles triangle ABG. Pause the video, you will be able to recollect what I said step by step so that you can reach to this conclusion. Two, three. I hope you have checked your answer. Now coming from this, this is an isosceles triangle ABD. Therefore, BE is equal to ED. Now here it is not drawn to the scale, so it does not look like one. But if you take this as a value say X, this also has X. So what you get is the entire length BC is 2X plus 18 centimeter. Now our step 3 will be to find out find out X and H where X is part of the length measuring from B to E or E to D and H is the altitude of the triangle. Right. You have two triangles, two right angle triangles. Namely, triangle AED, AED and triangle AEC. Here, the basis in triangle AEB, the basis X right the perpendicular is is H and the hypotenuse is 18 centimeter in AEC the base is this is 18 plus x and measured in centimeter. I have not mentioned here. You observe the centimeter. Here it is also centimeter. Right. The base is 18 plus x centimeter. The perpendicular is 8 centimeter and your hypotenuse here changes. is 30 centimeter. Now by using Pythagoras theorem, by using Pythagoras theorem, what we get? We get in triangle AEB, if I use Pythagoras theorem for triangle AEB, you will get x square plus h square is equal to 18 square. So if you elaborate this, you will get x square equals to 18 square minus x square. So we can take this as one result. Similarly, in triangle AEC, Eighteen plus x square plus x square 
is equal to 30 square. If you write this in terms of h square, then it will be 900 minus 18 plus x square. Right? So this is your second question. So pause the video, try to come to this solution so that you will understand how we have come to this point. Uh, using the results 1 and result 2, so we can actually combine these two. We get 3, 2, 4 minus x square equals to 900 minus, you have to expand this. So what do you get? I get a 3, 2, 4, right? I get a 3, 2, 4 plus uh, 2, 36x plus x square. Now if you open this, you will get 900 minus 3 to 4. So what is 900 minus 3 to 4? 900 minus 3 to 4. You can make this 10, This you make this 89. So 10 minus 4 is 6. This is 7. This is 5. So I get a 5, 7, 6 here. Minus 36x minus x square. Now this is 3 to 4 minus x square. So we have minus x square common on both sides. In transition of any one of these we will strike it off. So I can take this 36x this side and 576 minus 324 this side. So I subtract 3 to 4. So I get a 2 I get a 5, I get a 2. So this is 2, 5, 2, 36 times of x. So x value is 2, 5, 2 divided by 36. So 36 sevens are is 252. So 36 ones are 36 sevens are. So x is 7 centimeter. So if you have got x value, so you will get dc as 2 times of 7 plus 18. So what is 2 times of 7? It is 14. 14 plus 18 is 32 centimeters. So now I have got a triangle. A, B, C, where B, C is 32 centimeter. I have an A, C as 30 centimeter and A, B, as 18 centimeter. So I can use Heron's formula hmm? because it's a scaling triangle. The most convenient is under root of S, S minus A, S minus B, S minus C. So what is S here? S is semi perimeter. It is 32 plus 30 plus 18 whole divided by 2. So this is 80 by 2. So S is 40. So you have 40 centimeters. So this is a semi perimeter. What is S minus A? So if you see S minus A, this is A, this is B, and this is C for our calculation purpose. So what is S minus A? So you see S minus A is 8 centimeters. What is S minus B? It is 10 centimeters. What is S minus C? It is 22. I hope we can uh, use these values here to our Heron's formula. So what is S? S is 40. 40 into what is S minus A? That is H into what is S minus B? That is 10. And what is S minus C? That is 22. Now if you put this in the form of factors, 
What is to get? 40, that is 8 into 5. This is 8. What is 10? It is 5 into 2. What is 22? It is 2 into 11. So, this is equal to 8 into 5 into 2 into root 11. So, what is 8 into 5? 8 into 5 is 40. This is 80 and root 11 square centimeter. This is the area of the required triangle ABC of the question. Thank you very much for watching our videos. Uh, if you have enjoyed our video, please mention that in the comment box. Thank you very much. Kindly subscribe if you have not subscribed and press the bell icon if you want to watch similar type of videos in future. Thank you very much. Shabakya.